Record. <gasps> Recording! Hey, I'm doing this myself. Mandy's sitting over there, but, you know. Hey, it's Betty from Betty's Creative Studio. I want to show you something I had so much fun making, okay? Uh, we'll show you the board that came in from Inky Antics first, okay? This, it, whoop, this is a scratch-off board. So all these little silver circles, or in this case, all these little silver circles, can be scratched off for a secret message hidden underneath. Okay, we scratched off one, which is right there. Okay, so you have the little silver things that you put over them. And I love the fish, he isn't he cute? He's just adorable. It's my, like, probably my favorite one. There are, however, some uh, uh, extra ones. And um, hang on, because did I get it in order? No. But the scratch offs come in little packages like this in four different sizes. Okay, so if you have other items besides the Inky Antic stamps that you want to make, scratch offs with here they are very easy they're just stickers but this is the card that i made with the um what they call this one uh balancing seals okay yes i did it myself no mandy no nancy i did this one myself okay so it says here it says uh hey goofball okay if you scratch it off it says you're awesome Okay, so that, that's just my little card. Didn't do anything, just, uh, just that. But I'm going to show you real quick how I put it together. First of all, I stamp the image I want in front, because if you'll notice, he's sitting on a drum. So then I'm going to drop the paper. Uh, I'm going to put a mask over it. Okay, here's another seal that I cut just the bottom out, because that's the only part we're masking is his little flippers, okay? So I got him covered, all right? Sorry, I'm doing it myself, like I said. So we're gonna put him in the misty, and we're gonna take the little drum, and we're going to figure out where we want the drum to be. Is that where I want it? Yeah, that's about where I want it. Okay, close the misty, see? pick up the drum where I want it. It's going to stamp right there. And then we see the magic of masking. Thank you, Mandy. <laughs> Mandy handed me, I'm using, our, I'm using just, uh, actually it's Nina paper, okay? I didn't even use watercolor, which I could have used. You need watercolor, uh, I'm using archival ink, so I, and I was planning to do these in watercolor, so uh, it's, uh, you could use Bristol, you could use watercolor. The Nina paper works really nice too. And, well, looky here. <gasps> and now, because, oh, well, here's the mask. Let me do that. Let me show you the whole way there. Bye, Gary. Okay, there, there it was stamped when I, and I take the mask off and voila, he's sitting on the drum instead of the drum being over him or anything else. How's that, huh? Pretty cool. So then I went ahead and I colored him, which I'm not going to do right here, okay? And I, um, I'm not going to color him, but I'm going to show you. I took the, this is the ball for the top, okay? And I decided where I wanted that to go on his nose or whatever and used, again, the Misty to put the ball where I wanted it. I just want to show them putting on the... Uh, Okay, we'll get rid of that. Close that up. We got the ball. There's the ball on his head. Okay, cool, right? So then, we'll go, and then, and then, and then, and then, and then, like I always do, right? We're gonna take one of the sayings on here, which are, uh, hope you have a ball today, you get the seal of approval, uh, or happy birthday, you're awesome, or hey goofball, which was my favorite. Uh, it's fun to be sealy with you. That sounds like me and my sister, right? Let's celebrate. Well, we're going to use, I hope you have a ball today. And this is why the Misty or any stamping tool comes in so handy, because we're going to place that saying right in the middle of the ball. Okay. So I'll show you. There it is. Okay, without ink. Just exactly where I want it. You know, you, you, know, you don't know how you did all these things without a stamping tool before this, right? Okay, so we're gonna stamp in. I hope you have a ball today. There it is, okay? 
not, just pretend I colored it, okay? Because you don't want to sit there and watch me color it. So then, then we take a sticker, see? It's a little silver sticker, and I'm going to place it over the saying that I, and thank God it has, uh, it has some give, okay, if you don't get it on there right the first time. Okay, there you go. Now you can't see what I said. So we're going to take another stamp. Oh, I'll tell you what's really cute that you can use. They actually have this ball thing to make the lines for the ball. So we're going to use that. Just make it look like a little ball. Got to love the Misty. Got to love the Misty. Oops. That's all right. Like I said, you always put it in the corner, and we can always double check that, right? Ooh, bad. It moved. It really moved. There we go. Okay, so we're going to take the, uh, the little stripes for the beach ball. And there you go. You got a stamped beach ball. And not to forget, I know I'm taking every stamp. There's a little sign here that says, scratch here. Okay, scratch, scratch off circle to reveal message. Okay. So again, we're going to put that down right near the scratch off. This was really, oh, let's get rid of that. I got stamps all over the place, don't I? Here? <laughs> but actually, everything you need to make several different cards, because this stamp set also comes with, um, see, scratch off to reveal message. This one comes with um, two seals. The ball, there's the thing to make all the lines. You got all the sayings and the little drum for him to stand on. Oh, and he even has a party hat. You know, I hadn't done that. I hadn't done the party hat. I think he needs one, don't you? Yes. Yeah, let's just you give him a party it. hat while, while we're at it, okay? Yeah. You can have it at a jaunty angle. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Right like that. A little party hat. Oh, same thing, though. Where's my mask? Hang on a minute. We'll put yeah, the mask cut, back yeah, on. Cut. Well, I have a cut. No, I don't have a cut around that area. No. All right. Hang on. Betty's cutting. Real quick. Because I'm a quick cutter. Especially with these wonderful Tim Holtz five-inch snips. These are the best things since sliced bread, aren't they? Mm -hmm. I think so. I think okay, so, so we're going to put, we just trimmed the, ma the thing up a little bit more over here because I decided to mask another part of him. And we're just going to put that in with a little bit of repositionable tape. Decide where we want our hat to be. This should work, and if it doesn't, next. It, as we always say, it's just a piece of paper. Yeah, I know, I moved it. Sorry, got to do that again, folks. I moved it. Saw that. <laughs> it's a common mistake. Mandy's correcting me, but that's okay. Kind of everybody does. <laughs> well, it's a common mistake to make. Though, yeah, I know. I do it all the time, time with this. Yeah. yeah, I do it all the time. Well, let's see. Eh, it could have been better. All right. Well, let's forget that part. Okay. So then here we have the. Uh, this is one's all covered, and of course I did a uh, hey goofball on there. So then we're going to take, oh my God, I have no coins. <laughs> we need a penny. Here, let me grab one off here. There's a whole bunch of them on the display. Okay, see? So we're going to take a coin now and scratch this, just like a lottery ticket, to reveal underneath that it says, You're awesome! Now, how is that for an adorable little card, okay? And here's the one, where's the one I messed up? Oh, I left it in the misty. All right, I went a little too far with the, uh, with the hat thing, okay? So you see his hat didn't come out real good, but you know what? It's a piece of paper. But I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to scratch off the little circle that we put on there, and there it reveals the message that says, hope you have a ball today. Is that not the most adorable stuff in the whole world? Now, let me show you what else 
I mean, you saw that that's the seal one. It just happens to be the one I opened, okay? So you got you got all the you get the seals and the drum and all that. But yeah, I just wanted to show you a quickie on the masking, which you know I did really really good on this one, but really really bad on that one. Oh, I didn't miss it. Well, it's all right. We have a gumball machine, okay? Same thing, and this one takes the two inch scratch offs. So anything you have that has a like about a two inch um, circle on it can be used as a scratch off one. That one's not on my board, and this is another one that's not on my board. Uh, this is called coffee break, and again you have the big ring for the coffee. Is that That's not great. funny? Yeah. This is a great one, and that one will fit uh, the one and a half inch scratch offs. Okay, and then this one, which is a furry friendship. Okay which has a lot of nice things on it. So you have the flower, and you have the balloons, and those take the little ones, okay? Um, but this one has lots of nice sayings on it that you can, here, I'll get it closer, okay? That you can really see. Yeah, I know, it's surprising, but yeah, even though I've owned a store for 12 years, yeah, I know how to do this stuff. You believe that? <laughs> I really do. Okay, so this is, uh, Happy Travels, which is on, which is one that's on the board, and again, you put all little tiny sayings in here, and it gets covered with the square, okay? Because even the little ones are too small on that one. But uh, these are these are fun because you got all these little icons too that can go in the circles, or you can use the little words. Look what I did to that poor thing when I took the. I ripped or it. Or even a little alphabet stamp. You could yeah, the a alphabet stamp. Underneath. I don't know what. I uh, Let me, here, this is the one they did with the travels again. Okay, see, they used all the little icons in but there. But you could have it's a little really alphabet adorable. stamp on the Oh, absolutely, it yeah, a, anything. And a little just, hidden message yeah. or something like that. That's what's nice, yeah. You can, you can, I mean, you could write a hidden message under yeah. it and cover it up. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Okay, so this is Bubble Bear, which is really, really cute, too. He's the one I just ripped the penny off of and ripped half the stamp off there, too. Um, and this is one has been our biggest seller. This is Fortune Teller. Okay. Uh, I'll show you again the sample with the Fortune Teller. You can see what I did to the poor bear here. I ripped his penny off. Um, and the most one, of the one we sold out of, Bubbly Fish. <laughs> this guy is so adorable. Okay. If I'm going to do another one, I'm going to use one of those and uh, this one I this one sold really well too I was a little surprised but it did this is blue ribbon okay and again number one everybody okay mm -hmm. number one teach and number one dad yeah. and and that one was down here so you can see the sample again now uh, I'm getting beeped at there so I know that it's running out of recording time so uh, I'm gonna close this up but I want to let you know that if you go on my site Betty's creative studio.com and buy any of these products with any other order. Okay, you can buy other stuff. I've got the new distress colors on there, uh, a pre order for the Tim Holtz, uh, uh, we're not supposed to talk about stamp platform. And uh, I almost any, I have about 1,700 items so far on my website. It, but if you buy any of the inky antics that I've shown today, you will get a rebate. For the very first person that places an order on this, you're going to get a rebate of 40% of your sale back for your next purchase on my website. And the second person is going to get 35% back. And then 30 and 25. So the faster you order, the faster you're going to get a good discount. Everybody is going to get at least a 10% rebate if you, if you order any of my Inky Antic scratch off stamps. And of course, and don't forget to get these, the stickers that you scratch off, okay? Any purchases of these will, will allow you to get a rebate. So in other words, if you spend, uh, well, say you spend $100 on my website, because you're nice, okay? If you spend $100, you'll get a coupon for $40 off mm -hmm. your next order, okay? Yeah. And the next person gets 35 off the next order if it's 100. I'm just basing it on 100, but you're going to get 40%, 35, it depends. So rush to your computers, like you're not watching it on YouTube right now. Go to Betty's Creative Studio.com, place an order for the Inky Antics, and you will get a coupon back 
for whatever, wherever you fall. The first one's going to get 40, then 35, then 30. Uh, what comes after 30? 25, and then 20. <laughs> 15. 15, and, and 10, everybody's going to get at least 10. 10. Okay, so hurry up and order the Inky Antics Scratch Off Surprises line today at Betty'sCreativeStudio.com. If you don't want to order online, give me a call, 336-389-9539. And as always, be kind to somebody today because you don't know what people are going through. And uh, we hope to see you soon. And we'll be open on the 4th. And we're open on July 4th, yeah. Okay, this is my July 4th special, rebates. Don't you love rebates? Okay. Yay! Well, if you don't understand, email me, okay? Uh, you can get me on Facebook at Betty's Creative Studio, or you can email me at Betty's Creative Studio at gmail.com. I'll answer you immediately because I'm always on the internet. Always. Okay? I live in the cloud. Okay, anyway, take care of yourself, and we hope to see you soon. Ta-ta.